So today we will be making the perfect backup for IBIS Paint X. So firstly go to the settings tab in IBIS, scroll down and press the backup settings and select ZArchivo or any file manager you use and press OK. After that go to Android Data IBIS Cache Share and select the file and copy paste it somewhere else. I am saving it in my memory card but you can save it anywhere. I am creating a new folder called IBIS Backup. And now go back to your IBIS Data folder and open Files folder this time and copy all files and paste to your Backup folder. After that's done, download latest version of IBIS and as you can see I don't have anything in it right now. I don't have any color palettes or any fonts or anything. So now we will go back to our file manager and open the settings file which will redirect us to IBIS. Then just press OK by selecting all and now you will be able to see all your previously saved colors and gradients. As you can see all my previous colors and gradients have come back. Now change the storage type to 2 and copy all your IBIS backup files and paste in the same IBIS data folder we copied them from. I didn't select fonts folder because I have lots of them and it lags when I copy paste all of them together. After doing all the above steps, open your IBIS and press OK and you will be able to see all your projects soon. Let me create a new project and show you the fonts as well. And as you can see, all your fonts will also be present there just like that. And that's it, that's how you create perfect backup for IBIS. Just a disclaimer, I don't recommend you guys using IBIS Paint X mod versions, but we all have our reasons to do so. That's why I just showed you how you can do it perfectly without losing any of your previous projects. That's it for today, see you in the next one.